It's that time of the year when shark appreciation comes to the surface. And at SeaWorld <laughs> Orlando, shark fanatics can get the ultimate encounter. And a week-long event allows guests to have a unique, immersive day through the ultimate shark experience. News 6 producer and theme park expert Landa McReynolds visited SeaWorld's Shark Encounter to find out about the special VIP access as well as these very important predators. The Shark Ultimate Experience brings guests into the park to experience our sharks more than anybody ever has. We get to touch sharks, you get to see sharks, you get to learn about sharks, you get to feel sharks, and you also get to ride like a shark and swim like a shark on our thrill rides. You get to take home a souvenir to remind you of your visit. You get to enjoy wonderful food and drinks that are inspired by the ocean and the sharks. So what's different about this ticket is most guests when they walk through the park get to walk through this tunnel and see all of our sharks. With this ticket, guests get to be up top and look down at the sharks, a completely different angle, all while listening to Aquarius talk about the biology, the husbandry of the sharks that we have here in the park. Every ticket that is sold for the Shark Ultimate Experience, $25 from the ticket goes towards shark conservation that will help marine life and sharks in the ocean to thrive and survive. The biggest threat that sharks face in the world is humans. It's the threat of us overtaking their habitats, of overfishing, of not being knowledgeable about sharks. Shark enthusiasts can come and soak it all up, mainly in our shark habitat, where you will see seven different species. We also have other shark species in our manta habitat and also in our journey to Atlantis aquariums. So as guests approach the tunnel and the building, we have graphics displaying different sharks, uh, their features, how to identify them, so guests can enjoy the experience. We have sand tiger sharks, which are some of the most iconic sharks that have lower hanging jaws where you can see all their teeth. They're the sharks that scare most people. We also have sandbar sharks. We have a zebra shark. We have one in here, his name is Darwin. He is also very iconic and people notice all the time. We also have a small tooth sawfish, which you can identify by the long saw or rostrum that has a lot of teeth sticking out of the side. We have two great hammerheads, Dutch and Dylan, both males, and they rule this habitat. These sharks get fed twice a week, most sharks in this habitat. However, Dutch and Dylan do get fed every day just because they have higher metabolisms, they swim a lot more than some of the other sharks. Dutch and Dylan get fed every day, mainly because their metabolisms are much higher than the other sharks. Some of the sharks in here, for example, the nurse sharks, lay around all day. They don't expend a lot of energy. Dutch and Dylan expend more energy, therefore require more calories, more food. Um, as a supervisor, I actually started feeding sharks and feeding stingrays in the feeder booths and growing up through that and then working my way and learning about so many different types of animals in the aquarium department, working in our quarantine facility where we quarantine a lot of different sharks that you see here now and then ultimately this is where I am over this habitat right now. For me, my day um, can be completely different every day, but overall what we're here for is for the animals. We're making sure their habitat and their water is perfect for them in their daily life. We're cleaning, we're feeding, we're monitoring water chemistries, everything that helps these animals have the best life. So cool. Yes. Now, by the way, there are 23 sharks and rays in the shark exhibit. 
And guess what? It holds also 700,000 gallons of wow. salt water. <laughs> and you may have noticed how blue the light was during the interview. The light corresponds to the shark's circadian rhythms. And Landon says the tunnel lighting was still really blue during the time he was there since it was still morning. And the Ultimate Shark Experience debuts tomorrow and runs through next Friday. We have ticket info on this web story at clickorlando.com. You know, I was talking about Sharks Underwater Grill. Right. It's yeah. a fun little place to eat when you have some time to take time and enjoy because it's panoramic views Very cool. of the sharks swimming by. Yeah, I've never been there. Yeah. Maybe I'm we'll, inspired to go. Maybe we'll get your kids to actually eat, right? Yeah. <laughs> or take a date. Or take a date. That's true. Well, every Friday morning, Landon compiles the biggest stories on our attractions into one newsletter for you. It's a really fun newsletter. Sign up for the free In the Loops theme park scoops newsletter at clickorlando.com slash newsletters.